guys, welcome back. So today's video is a what I got for my birthday video. I turned 30 this year, so I got a few more presents than I usually would because, I mean, it was a bigger birthday. I had a birthday party, which I don't usually do. Um, and the presents that I got are absolutely amazing and I really wanted to share them with you. They um, There's quite a few things here that I feel like are good gift ideas anyway. It's something that would be good um, if you have a birthday coming up that you need to buy presents for. I just thought these were really good ideas. Um, and yeah, I love watching these kinds of videos. I think they're really, really fun to watch. I know some people do think these can be a little, little bit braggy, so I just wanted to let you know that I'm not trying to brag about any of this stuff. I just honestly got some really cool stuff that I really want to share with you. So I'm going to start with... <laughs> See, pretty much everything I've got, I could probably say is my favourite thing that I got. I got some amazing things, but this one has a special place in my heart, and I really want to show this to you first because it's really, really cool. This was from my sister. She got me some really, like, she did really, really well. She does well all the time, but she did really, really well this year. Are you ready? Are these not the cutest thing you've ever seen in your life? It is Mrs. Potts, if you're not aware. Mrs. Pot and Chip from Beauty and the Beast. How adorable are these? They are ceramic. Um, they're not plastic or anything. And Mrs. Potts, the teapot, she is a real teapot, so she, you really could have a cup of tea out of Mrs. Pot. How cute is she? I'm pretty sure my sister got these from Etsy and I'm pretty sure um, I can find the seller because she commented to one of her friends on Facebook which where she got it from. So I'll see if I can find it and if I can I'll link it below. Um, but how gorgeous is it? I absolutely am obsessed with these and she was so funny my sister. She was like I know these don't really go with the decor in your home so you don't need to put them out but I freaking love them. I'm gonna put them somewhere. I'm trying to find her a home. Well they're my home. Um, I think they're gonna go in my kitchen in those, if you've seen my like, kitchen tour or any other of my videos, I've got a little shelf on the side of my kitchen um, cabinet, so I'm going to try and put them in there. They're a little bit too small at the moment. They need to go on like a little tray or something, so I'm going to try and find a tray to put them on. But absolutely love them. They're so cute. So adorable. They were. I was so excited when I opened them. Also for my sister, I got this really pretty ring. The stones that she picked are... Um, Taylor's birthstone and Owen's birthstone and they also happen to be my mine and my sister's birthstone because we are both um, both Taylor and my sister are born in June and me and Owen are both born in July so it's for sisters and for my children as well so it's one of these ones that goes all the way around and then has a gap I don't know what this kind of style is called but yeah it has a gap in the middle and I absolutely love it it's so pretty um not sure where she got that one from but there are there are quite a few of these on Etsy so you'll be able to find it Easily enough. What shall I show you next? From one of my oldest friends, I got I'm sorry, this really pretty necklace. It's quite a um a short necklace, so it sort of sits right here. And it is Swarovski Swarovski crystals. Um clear Swarovski crystals on just a really simple gold chain. Um I can't remember the brand off the top of my head, but I will find it for you because it's a brand that I had heard of before. And um, I wanted the website to have a look at what else they had because I really thought this was quite pretty. So she got me that. And then also to go along with it, this little jewelry plate. So this holds my sort of everyday jewelry. Um, the brand for this is Zakaya, Z A double K I A. And it's still a little, I think this is called Terrazza. Terrazza, I'm not sure. Um, this style of stone I guess you'd call it um, and it's pink and really pretty and it just sits with my jewelry in it my chest of drawers in my room so I'll insert a little clip of how I have that and I really really like that I think it's super pretty I didn't really have anything before I was using like a um a soy sauce dish to keep all my um jewelry in before so this is much prettier much for that that's gorgeous I love that from my grandparents I got this Sheridan bathrobe and it's just a white, a plain white one. Um, it's really, I can't really show. It's super, super long. It goes all the way, st almost down to my ankles. Um, has a couple of pockets and it's a flannel material. A lot of the other um, robes that I have, I have a lot of robes. I have like three. Um, all the other robes that I have are fluffy, like a fluffy robe from like Target. I think I've got most of them from. Um, whereas this one is more like toweling kind of material. So it's really, really nice. It's really heavy. So it's quite thick and you feel quite warm in it. But then also it's not bulky because it's not that fluffy material. It's it's quite a thin yet heavy towel material. So that's really, really nice. Um, I as soon as I got that because I was still sort of dressed up I was at the end of my party I started opening everything up and I put it straight on because I was just in a little dress and I was getting quite cold at that point 
Um, so they did really well with that. Um, from one of my parents' friends, I got this cute little clutch bag. I'm not sure what the brand is. It doesn't have a tag or anything on it, but it is like a little pouch. There is a strap that you can put onto it, just a plain gold strap, and you clip them onto the edges there. And it's a nice neutral color, so I really like this, and I'm sure I'll be able to use this probably in summer more so than any other time. Um, I really like the tassel as well. I think that's really pretty. It's kind of metallic, but the back's kind of a metallic... And then the front is like a is a woven, like a bit scratchy. Really like that. From another of my parents' friends, um, I got this Jimmy Choo perfume. I've never, I don't even know what it is. I'll have to have a look at their website and see what um, what the name of the perfume is. But it's just this, in this really pretty pink bottle, which looks really really pretty up where this my perfumes are. Um, I think it's really it's really quite risky to get someone perfume as a present because unless you know for sure that that's something that they use. Uh, I've never used this one before, but I really, really like it. I think it's it's a floral scent, and I never used to really like floral scents when I was younger, but as I've gotten a bit older, um, I definitely really like florals now. So she did really, really well picking that out because, yeah, I love it. I've been wearing it um, the last week or so. It's really nice. Also from that same friend, I grabbed, um, she, I grabbed, I did not grab, she got me this really pretty little like nail care kit, um, comes with like to toenail separators, some cuticle sticks, uh, nail clippers, little scissors and a cuticle cutter and it's, oh and, and also I think this is a pusher as well, I wouldn't, I don't usually use these, um, but I thought this was really, really pretty and it comes in a really cute floral case really sweet from that friend's daughter so she's a few years younger than me but we used to hang out a lot when we were kids um i got she did a few little things i think actually yeah three things um so this little i think it's a notepad yeah this little just plain notepad from typo it's a really nice soft pink color and it came with this pen which is sort of a rose gold metallic and then has pinkish rose gold glitters in that top section there it's just a little ball, ballpoint pen I don't know how to do it how do you do it oh you twist it at the bottom <laughs> um that came together that was really cute that's from typo so you should be able to find that on their website I'll see if I can link it below and with that she gave me this oh, I can't pronounce this Locatane um hand cream it is the cherry blossom scent which I don't use a lot of hand cream, but it is nice to have it because there are times, obviously, that my hands are dry. And because I never buy it for myself, it's nice to have something on hand. And this is a really, really nice one. So I look forward to using that on the day that my hands are dry. Um, that same friend also got me this pair of socks from Peter Alexander, um, which these are so sweet. They're so cute. Pink and white stripe. And then they've got pom-poms on the back. And they're quite long, like they come quite far up my legs. Um, she did get me the medium to large size, so they're a little bit big for me. But because they're just lounge socks, it doesn't really matter. They just need to go on your feet. But they're really, really cute. So I really liked those. She did really, really well, that friend. I, have, I don't really see her very often anymore because um, she lives a little bit further away and we don't get to catch up. But she did really, really well. And then her twin sister, this is all from these guys. She, she came at the very last minute. She wasn't going to come to my party. She had something else to do and then sort of like half an hour before the party started she asked like she realized that she didn't have to go to that place anymore um and she was able to come to me so i wasn't expecting a present from her at all but she grabbed this i believe it's a kmart gift basket i don't know if she's put this together herself or if they just sell it as a set i'm not sure i've never i don't i've never really looked if kmart do gift baskets maybe they do i don't know but the stuff that's in it i absolutely love so this mug is absolutely huge like it's the size of my face um, and this I think you can get this separately so I don't because I don't know if she's bought these all separately and put it together or, or what's going on but this is the mug I haven't used this yet because I wanted to show it in this video first um, but it's really good for soup because it's so big or like just anything it's so pretty I love it I love the watercolor and the colors that are on it um, there are some bath bombs in here which I did say Taylor can use these ones because she was like what are those mom what do they do she thinks that there's um, a toy inside, but she's wrong. They're adult ones. Um, there was this, what are these called? Diffuser, reed diffuser. And I've lost, I don't know what I've done with the reeds that came with it. So I remember I opened it up to smell it, but then I must have just lost the reeds. So I have to find some new ones. Um, but that's really, really nice as well. There is just a loofah, some exfoliating gloves, which I love to use. And then just a little 
face wash it there. And then the actual basket that it came in, I'm pretty sure you can buy this separately as a fruit basket. So I really like this. Um, I'll definitely be able to put that somewhere in the house. I love that. From another one of my parents' friends. I feel like everything is from my parents' friends. I feel like all my friends got me gift vouchers and then my parents' friends and my family are the ones that got me actual gifts. But from my other, another of my parents' friends, I got this rug. I think this is actually from Big W. So it's a really nice chunky knit um, throw rug with tassels on the bottom and it's just in sort of a, probably a cream color. I really like that. That's been in our living room on our couch, which I'm really, really happy about that because it's winter and I'm obsessed with throws and all that kind of thing. Um, those are there. Um, from one of the school mums, um, she got me, she framed this photo of my little family in this really pretty frame from Target. She's done just a black and white print and I can't really... Really, that was really, really thoughtful of her. And then she got me this grapefruit and cassius candle, which I have been burning. I'm nearly done. Um, again, from Target. And this is really, really nice. I went there to smell some of their other candles because I haven't really looked at their candles lately because I remember going a few years ago and they weren't that great. But then after I got this, I went back and had another smell. And I got this one. I'll show you. And I got this. Oh, it doesn't say. It was like pink mango wood and... something else some spice I don't know um really really they're both really really nice if you like some fruitier scents go check out these in Target because I think you will like them from the girls that I work with my co work with my colleagues I got this lantern I don't know if I've shown you I actually already have the larger version of this in my living room um so they got me the smaller one to sort of match it which I'm obsessed with I love this more rustic colored wood. I think it's really, really pretty. It's not glossy at all. It's um, just sort of bare raw wood. I really, really like that. And then it's got a hurricane in it. So you can put a candle in there. I'm not going to bother doing that yet, but Christmas time, I will definitely be doing that. And then they also got me this tray, which I did say that I would quite like to receive this tray as a present. So they sort of knew what they were doing when they bought this. Um, this was from a new homewares boutique that opened up near our workplace recently. So it's really cool. Again, it's a really, really rustic, just raw wood with sort of um, iron handles. And then the feet are these really cool pegs. So I really like that. And I've been using this on my dining table. I don't know if you saw my last video, you might have seen it. Um, on my dining table with my fruit bowl on top just to give it a little bit of extra height. And because my, my table is round, I think it sort of suits it quite well. So really like that. They did really well out those things for me and then from my husband and my kids I got I actually asked for these so this is <laughs> this is what I wanted um these running shoes well, they're not running shoes apparently my husband used to work at Rebel Sport when he was in uni and so you know he would sell sell, sell shoes and he told me that Nike don't really make very good running shoes they sort of advertise themselves as running and like athletic shoes but they're not very good in support or anything so I'm not allowed to wear these when I'm playing any sport like netball or going running or anything these are only casual apparently so these are the Air Max or the Nike Air Max Thea I think it is the name of the shoe um really really cool I like these I'll be wearing these with my leggings um on school runs and things I never sort of really wore these kind of shoes before I had kids but now I find I'm finding that I really, really like them. They're comfy and they're easy to wear, obviously. Um, and they look pretty cool. I never had black, I've never had black like sneakers before, so that's a new thing for me. And then also from Joe, we're gonna go when the weather kind of nicens up a little bit more when the sun comes out. Um, we're gonna go and have a night away, just the two of us, somewhere in Perth. Probably the crown again. Um, and that will be for my 30th, but it's the middle of winter and I wanted to be able to make use of the pool and that kind of thing when we go. So we're gonna wait until probably probably more like October, November, that kind of time. So yeah, that is everything I wanted to show you today. Oh, I almost forgot the one last thing. Um, my best friends, our couple best friends, um, went in with a couple other friends and their mum and they got me this really amazing clock. I haven't got it here to show you, but I'm gonna insert a little clip. Um, this beautiful, beautiful clock. I absolutely love it. It's got a wood frame. The numbers are made out of metal, like the silver metal. So it's got that really rustic feel to it. It's beautiful. It's just the right size for my kitchen. Um, the clock that I had there previously was the same size as the new one. So the hook was there, ready to go. Um, I just had to swap it over. So 
absolutely love it. Every time I look at it, I'm just like, oh, I'm in love. I love it so much. That was, again, one of my favorite things that I got for my birthday. I also got a whole lot of vouchers, so I'll be using them when I go shopping. Um, a lot of Coles Meyer, a lot of sports girls, so people know me well. They know where I like to shop. So that is everything I got. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give me a thumbs up if you did and subscribe if you haven't already. Um, as always, thank you so much for watching, and I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye!